Hello. Family, friends, fans, and fellow adventurers. Welcome back. To the weekly Wednesday video game stream. Uh, let's see what's going on in the chat. Um, two Beast Josh. 554, five, I had to double check that wasn't a 6. Don't worry about it. It's all good. I hope the work trip was as good as a work trip can be. <laughs> um, and I see you're playing World of Warcraft. I don't do much World of Warcraft myself. I don't know much about it, but I do know, if I remember correctly, I believe there's a new expansion. So I hope that's... Uh, cool i hope it's going well sorry there's a big old tangle in headphone wires happening right now and i'm just trying to make sure that is not in my way there we go i'm back hello <laughs> hello hello uh, yes, I'm back from sorting out a headphone wire tangle. Now we're playing something a little different today. We've come in with a new game after being relentlessly trolled by Pokemon Mystery Dungeon last week, which we will not talk about, and then finishing it off with some Trombone Champ last week. Uh, we have something slightly different today, because let, let's, let's get the mic up a bit. Let's get the mic a bit closer to me. There we go. Something different today, because uh, I received a little present to myself in the post, and I've used it, which means now, now, dear intrepid viewers, we can finally officially emulate Nintendo things, and I can use my Nintendo Switch for streaming my lovely Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee edition Switch. And, speaking of emulating, the music, presumably, is giving you an indication of what we might be doing today. I hope it's giving you an indication of what game we'll be playing today, if you haven't already guessed from seeing it in the game being played section of the stream information. But if you haven't seen that, let's, uh... Jump on over to the Switch screen. You can see here I've got uh, the trusty N64 emulator up where you can play things like Zelda, Mario Party, Pilot Wings. You can play Wave Race, some of the more interesting Pokemon games, Pokemon Snap. There's some Kirby 64 on here, F Zero, Majora's Mask. Uh, there we go, Lilat Wars, the original Star Fox name. <laughs> the original Mario Kart, some tennis. But, that's not what we're here for today. No, no, today we are here for one very specific game, one very specific reason. If we stop the music. Because we don't need that music anymore. No, no. The music we need is something that I haven't heard properly since I was about 15 and I sold my Nintendo 3DS to buy drums. <laughs> there we go. Just had to double check the uh, subtitles picked up the word drums properly because that could have gone very wrong. Um, without further ado, why don't we launch The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time? Original N64 version. Now this is coming through a bit quiet for me, so let's turn this up a little bit. Let's see what our volume at. Memory lane indeed. How is the volume for you guys? Is this good? I tried putting on my audio ducking so it quietens when I talk, but that doesn't seem to be working properly. Which is interesting, but that's fine. 
See, the thing is, I never really had my own N64. I always only ever played it at my cousin's house. But this seems like it's coming through quite quiet. Volume is crisp. Excellent. I do like a good crispy volume. Um... Excellent. Well then, let us start a new file. And also let's... Actually no, let's not map the arrow keys for now. Um, because I was about to say I want to map the arrow keys so that they work like the analog stick, but we might actually need the D-pad for something. <laughs> so that would be a stupid move. But, let's take a little stroll down memory lane, shall we? In the vast deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as the guardian spirit I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, the Kokiri even, live here. Each Kokiri has his or own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fit. <laughs> and now he's having a nightmare. Oh no, they're running away on a horse. Oh no, it's Ganon with his big long nose! How terrifying! <laughs> Navi! Navi, where art thou? Come hither! Good job. Good job, closed captions. You're, you're really nailing the subtitles. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the great Deku Tree! Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. Harry Potter, the boy without a fairy. <laughs> the youth whose destiny it is to lead I rule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now, find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly, you fool. The fate of the world, the forest, nay, the world, depends upon thee. Why, you fool? Go on, Navi. I always hated that dude who's blocking the entrance to the Deku Tree. He always really annoyed me. Hey! Hey! Uh, God, I haven't missed Navi noises. Hello. Hello. The great Deku tree wants to talk to you. Mitch, get up! Shouldn't that say Link? Surely. Like, we're supposed to be Link. Hey, come on! 
Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? You finally woke up! I'm Navi the Fairy! The Great Deku Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you! The Great Deku Tree has summoned you, so let's get going right now! Oh yeah, there it is. There it is, the janky N64 controls. Oh yes, I'm home. <laughs> Oh god. The nostalgia noises. Go away, Navi. Right, there's nothing we can do inside. We must exit the tree into the Kokiri forest! <clears throat> Yahoo! Hi, Mitch! Say what you want about Legend of Zelda, but man, the nostalgia in this music on the N64 version, or just Ocarina of Time in general. I'm very happy playing this game. Wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, Mitch. Wow, that's great news. I'm so happy for you. Now you're a true Kokiri, Mitch. Is that right? The Great Deku Tree has summoned you. It's quite an honour to talk to the Great Deku Tree. I'll wait for you here. Get going. Go see the Great Deku Tree, mate. Go on. Go on, fella. What is it, Navi? This is absolutely my positive thing for the day. The Great Deku Tree has summoned you. Please come with me. Okay, that's great and all, but where? Bold of you to assume I remember the controls, Navi. Grab. Oh. Ha! Ah! That's Saria's house. Of course, I can't. Uh, change the camera angle at all, because this is the N64, that would be too easy. Uh, that's annoying. Now Mini, Mido made me cut the grass at Saria's ass. Mido told Saria he would do it so she would like him, but I'm the one doing all the work. Apparently all of the Kokiri talk like this now, so deal with it. You and Saria are close friends, so will you help me cut the grass? <laughs> I'll let you keep anything you find while cutting it. Apparently this is uh, this is just how the Kokiri speak. Okay. So just... Just let it happen. Okay, I can't cut the grass. House of Twins! <gasps> A pot! Yeet! Yes! Yes! Rupee acquired! Yeet! No! No! I want the rupee! Damn it! My sister took some rupees! I went shopping at the store! That has a red root, tee hee! Red roof! Speaking of rupees! A green one's worth one, a blue one's worth five, and a red one's worth twenty. Tee hee hee. There's a mythical sword Excalibur. Yeah. Can I grab that pot? No. I like that the music just continues from exactly where I'd left off. That makes me happy. <gasps> Yeet.
Oh god, the auto jump. You see a small mound of soft soil. Touch it. It's quite cool. Touch it, Frodo. It's quite cool. What is Z? What do I use for Z? Ah. No. That's strafing. That's the map. How do I... User guide? Yes. ZL is the Z button. Okay. Interesting. Ah, yeah, there we go. Yes, yes, that's how you use a fairy. It's so great to see that you finally have a fairy partner, mate. I'll teach you how to talk to people using your fairy. When a fairy flies near a person or a thing, press it to look in that direction, lad. If you use a Z targeting, you can talk to people from a distance like we are now. When you have nothing that you can target, you can press Z just to look forward. Try it. When a fairy flies near a person or a thing, press that. Yeah, we've already been through this, lad. we already done being through it, mate. Maybe if I walk away from her. And just do that. And then do that. And then do that. Boom. No. Okay. She has nothing else to tell me, nothing else to say. Oh, I think I'm clipping. Hold on. Test, 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 test. Yes, I am. I was clipping slightly on my, uh... Audio interface. I could see it flashing yellow. <laughs> Granted, flashing yellow is better than flashing red, but... Uh, you do know what to think of the voices for everyone. And it is to think that the voices are amazing. This shop it sells things you can get in the forest for free! Teehee! Do you know how to use a Deku shield, Teehee? When you get the shield, press start to get into the subscreens. Select the equipment subscreen with Z or R. On the equipment subscreen, choose the item you want to equip and press A to equip uh, item, lad! It's easy, it's not rocket science, mate. Once you equip it, hold it up with R and change its angle with the stick. Tee hee. Lovely jubbly. Welcome. Yeah. We sell shields, but not swords. Of course they sell shields. There's 40 rupees for a shield. You're having a laugh, ain't you? You're having a laugh, lad. You're having a laugh, ain't ya? 40 rupees for a shield. I'll get in the forest for free. Oh god, the auto jumping. Oh god, the auto jumping. Why does that emote look like me? Did you make your own custom emote? I love it. <laughs> what is this? Why don't I recognize the emote? You made your own custom emote. Amazing. I love it. Does it show up for other people to use? 
Or is it just for you? Because that's an amazing emote. <laughs> oh, you have a fairy now? That's great, Mitch. Lovely jubbly. What? You've been called by the great Deku tree. What an honor. He may give you a special gift, tee hee. It's his penis. That's because the great Deku tree is our father, the forest guardian, and he gave life to all of us, Kokiri, innit? Oh, that's awesome if other people can use it too. Sharing is caring and all that. Yes, blue rupee. Boom. Rupee acquired. Go me. Hell yes. Yeet. No. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. No. Well, that's all the rocks we can throw for now. We only got two rupees from it. Rip off. What a waste of rocks. <gasps> Chests. Boom. Five rupees. Boom. One rupee. Boom. Recovery heart. Even though we've taken no damage. <laughs> Five more rupees! Jackpot. Get lost, Navi. Navi, go away. Ow. <laughs> Pick up the rock link. Yes! No, there was no rupees in the rock. Damn it. Our oh, fairy finally came to you. Now you have a lot to learn. The best place to go to learn some new skills is in the forest training center. It's on the hill just above here. Should we do some forest training? The house of the know-it-all brothers. Do they truly know it all? Do they truly know it all? Boom! Rupee hidden in the pot. You know, when you think about it, Link really is just an absolute menace. He runs into people's houses, smashes up all the pots, steals all the money, and runs away. In the three yellow icons in the upper right... No, the three yellow icons in the upper right are called C icons. They display the things you can use with the left, down, and right buttons. Once you get a C button item, go into the select item subscreen and set it to one of the three C buttons. He really does know it all. Do you want to know how to use the up button? Yes! If you press up, you can change your view. In a place like this, it will switch to a top-down view. Outdoors in a field, for example, it will switch to a first-person perspective. Also, when Navi is displayed in the upper right of your screen, Navi the fairy wants to talk to you. Use up to listen to her. Say up. I am jealous of this way of life. I do not want to hear a long explanation. Thank you for the warning, my dude. Ah! 
Right. Shall we enter the training ground? But I have no sword. Hole of Z. Stand in front of the hole and push towards it. When the action icon shows, press A to crawl into the hole. Pay attention to what the action icon says. I have entered the hole. I am now inside the hole. It's quite cool. Turn around and try doing this right now. Ow. What the hell, man? I don't remember that being a thing. What is up with this boulder just following me around? Oh god, I think when I zoom in to use the camera, the controls are inverted. Here we go! It's time for the music! I got the sword! Hell yeah, sword acquired. So I need to... Quest... Oh yeah. You gotta punch jars. Ah, Kokiri sword. Equipped! Save, yes! Yes! Yes. Yes. <laughs> Ultimate power is mine. Follow the boulder. Follow the boulder. Yes. I'm going to cut the grass, but first... We make sure the boulder's not about to kill me. The boulder is conflicted. Boom! It's a very happy day. Enter the hole, Link! Foolish child, enter the hole! The boy is whole. What do you want? Hey, let's work on some moves! To jump sideways while Z-targeting, press A as you move right or left. To do a backflip while Z-targeting, press A as you move backwards. To do a roll attack while Z-targeting, press A as you move forward. While you roll, you can avoid damage. If you have your sword ready while Z-targeting, you can do a jump attack by pressing A. A jump does double damage. You can use Z-targeting on the stone next to me, so let's practice. Yeet. Oh, man. Oh, God. The nostalgia of the link noises.
how do I stop targeting? <laughs> Okay, well that just blew me over the ledge, that's what I wanted. I am pressing the Z button. It just changes target. Link is stuck forever! Although while we're at it, let's uh, let's do that. Let's make a suspend point, just in case! Yeah, ZL is the Z button. Ah, I just need to get far enough away. Ah, the days when there was no stamina bar. Hell yeah, you can destroy the sign, and best of all, you can still read it! No, you can't. I don't know what you're talking about, I always play Nintendo games on Nintendo consoles. I, I've i never not played a Nintendo game on a Nintendo console, I don't know what you're talking about. Every every Nintendo game I've ever, ever played has, has been on a Nintendo console. Right guys? Back me up guys. I just never showed my controller before because I'm I'm actually quite self-conscious about my controller. You seem sus. I'm just self-conscious about my controller, okay? Ugh. <laughs> Thank you, Max. Max has my back. Also, I'm seeing, apparently, according to the viewer numbers, it's entirely possible we may have some new viewers in here today. So if you are a new viewer, do feel free to give me a follow. I have put in some uh, custom alerts just for this game. So, don't let my hard work go to waste! I did cut the grass. Ugh doesn't even give me anything for cutting grass. Ugh. Yeah, thanks for the follow. I hope you heard the alert. I'll be very upset if you didn't hear the alert, but thanks for the follow. <laughs> Unfollow and refollow, just so you can get the alert again. I don't know if it'll do the alert again if you do that. <laughs> um, I want to get onto that roof so I can get those rupees. Aha! Oh, it's not rupees, it's hearts. Damn it, I thought it was red rupees. Although also, actually, I think you can't unfollow and refollow in a certain time frame, possibly. So maybe don't do that. No, Link! Don't go into the water! Oh god, I'm dreading the water temple already. No, Link! Link!
This always annoyed me as a kid. Look how annoying he is with his Michael Jackson side spinning, sliding, even. You saw the notification, but did you hear the noise? That's the question. Mr. No Fairy, what's your business with the Great Deku Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man. What? You've got a fairy? Say what? The Great Deku Tree has actually summoned you? What? It's unfortunately not Waluigi, but it is all thematic and on brand. <laughs> The alerts. Now I should be able to control the audio for the alerts via OBS. Oh, chat's reloading apparently. Whoops, my bad. Sorry guys, I just accidentally refreshed the chat. On the stream at least. Yeah, I think that's the only place that the uh, audio would come from. But, what I can do, if you guys didn't hear, is I can do this. I go to Stream Elements. And I log in. I'm pretty sure there's a button to replay the last... Did you hear that one? Because I did not. <laughs> Monitor and output. There we go. Let's test that again just to make sure I can actually hear it. There we go. I can hear it. It's official Legend of Zelda noises. Why would he summon you another great Mido? This isn't funny. I don't believe it, you aren't even fully equipped yet. Oh, believe me, buddy. I'm fully equipped. Oh, I do need a shield as well. Ugh. If you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Sheesh. Damn you, Mido. I will be back with a shield. There we go. Deco shield for 40 rupees. No, I don't want to buy anything else. That took all of my money. <laughs> Boom. Shield equipped. This is useful for later when I need to redirect projectiles a certain way. Okay, so I can't backflip. Wait, maybe it would help if I actually press the right button. I can still backflip while defending. Yes, I am now a true warrior. Whose wooden shield just fell straight in the water. Oh my god, I hate this jump. Every time. Get out of my way, Mido! Move! 
Move, you little prick. Oh, you have a Deku shield? And what's that? Is that the Kokiri sword? Good grief! Well, even with all that stuff, a wimp is still a wimp, huh? I, the Great Mido, will never accept you as one of us. Shoot, how did, it get, how did you get to be the same, the favor of Sari and the Great Tree? Grumble, grumble. Grumble all you want, mate. I am a true Kokiri now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Got about them. Hey! A Deku Baba. We got the Deku stick. Great for whacking, great for setting on fire. Boom. Bonked. Luke. And another one. Another one. Another one. Or are they just regenerating? Wow, I walked into him. Hey, oh, I can farm sticks. Excellent. Stick farming. My favorite pastime. I need to stop running into them. How many stick do I have now? Ten stick! Ten stick sounds like a good idea. Great Deku Tree, I'm back! Great Deku Tree! Oh, Navi! Thou hast returned. Mitch, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily thou hast felt it, Mitch. The time has come to test thy courage. I have been cursed, and I need you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. Dost thou have the courage enough to undertake this task? No. Of course I do. Then enter me, brave mage, and thou too, Navi. Navi the fairy, thou must aid Mitch. And Mitch, when Navi speaks, use up to listen well to the words of wisdom. The immersion. The immersion is strong. Inside the Deku Tree. So I had debated um, getting crowd control for this, so you can spend uh, channel points and stuff. Oh, oh, wrong button. Um, you can do things like spend channel points to um, to buy crowd control features uh, or pay or activate a specific crowd control feature. Um, so there were things like immediately refill my health <laughs> um, and various other similar, but that 
relies on me having an illegal emulated version of this game and using an emulator that is generally frowned upon by um, Nintendo. Yeah, if you said no to this, it would lock you out and you have to restart. And I wasn't doing all the restarting. I wasn't going back through all of that again. Jesus. Uh, yes, I have received his nut. The nut is uh, certainly in my possession. It's all over me. I have taken his nut deep inside me. Right, come on then, you little plant. Boom, nailed it. Boom. I can see down below the web using up. Nice. I don't like that it's inverted. And there's nothing I can do about it, apparently. Yep, there's nothing I can do about it. Yes, back to full hearts and a rupee. Look at this wall. Of course I can climb it, you fool. Ah, uh, yes. The spoders. Give me the slingshot. It's the dungeon map. Good jump. I can open a door by standing in front of it and pressing A. Pay attention to what the action icon says. That's the blue icon at the top of the screen. Berries and cream, berries and cream. Oh god. I don't like these guys. If I give you a clue, will you let me go? When you jump off a high cliff, if you hold forward, you will roll on the ground when you land and won't get out from the fall. I can't guarantee it work though if the cliff is really, really high. <laughs> I've no idea where that voice came from and I apologise. I'll try it out if you're feeling bold. And then he poops a heart. Oh, whoops. How did I do this? Oh, I need to spin the stick while pressing attack to do a spinning attack. Oh my god. But I can do a charge. Cool. No! 
Damn it, Link. Boom, slingshot. Excellent. Yay, hot. Shoot it with the slingshot. What's the C button? God. Ah, I need to equip it first. There we go. Oh, good lord. <laughs> Yump. Yump. Bonk. Bonk. Nailed it. And I got a rupee. Now, am I able? No. I can't slingshot from there. Boom. And that's the way the news goes. But he dropped something, and I want it. He dropped seeds. I want the seeds. Got him. Had to clip through the chest, but I got them. <laughs> Here we go. Climbing up tree. Right. Why does Navi keep flying away like she's looking at something? That's why. Boom. Okay. Big sculpture lad. Soft belly is its weak point. But I was aiming at the belly. Oh, 
Oh, I'm not. I need to get around to the other side. Okay. Boom. Those spiders used to terrify me as a kid. Which is probably the point. Whoa! Hello, sir! Trying to surprise me! Get wrecked, son! Is there a third one? There's always a third. Boom! Nailed it! Is this the fire tutorial? I think it just might be. Whoops. How do I... There we go. That worked. Uh... Boom! Whoops. <laughs> that was not a massively smart idea. My stick is on fire. No! Link! There we go. Whoops. There we go, and we put the stick away so it doesn't burn out. Because we're smart boys here. There's a spider over there, and there's a stick person there. Nailed it. I pressed up. Where's that other one I'm hearing? Oh, it's a gold one, isn't it? It's the first gold one. I mean, I have no idea what's uh, up there. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. 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 Destroyed a gold sculpture. A token proving I destroyed it. So now when I go into this menu. Boom. One sculpture token. And a little chest. With some heart. Let's do this puzzle then real quick. This little jumping puzzle. Classic N64 shenanigans. Damn it. Let's do the jumping puzzle real quick, and then we'll go for our tea break. Do 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 do. Oh, 
Well, that was close. Closer than I care to admit. Found the compass. There we go. And um, we got a rupee. Uh, I was going to get a deco stick from that guy, but I guess we've now jumped over, so we're not getting it. <laughs> and we're back. Uh, ooh, they're back too. Okay. Um, do I need to... No, you know what? We'll find out after the break. <laughs> Let's do a quick safety save. And then a double safety save. Boom. Let us go for our break now. For it is break time. And I will see you back here in about 10 minutes. See ya.
Well, that was my bad. Um, I completely forgot <laughs> to set the uh, music during the break. Apologies. <laughs> You had no music during the break. Sorry about that, guys, but we're back! I hope everyone got tea. Uh, apparently my webcam dropped a tiny bit. There we go. Uh, I hope everyone got tea during the break, because it is, after all, a tea break. The way we do it here. You are vibing to the sound of your own thoughts. Well, that's good. <laughs> I just accidentally saved, but that's okay, because there's no such thing as too much saving. You got water. It's quite cool. Water is quite cool. You are quite right. Excellent work, is in fact quite cool. Um, now, if memory serves, I don't believe there's a torch down there. Oh, these goddamn inverted controls. And if there's not a torch down there, but I can't. I don't remember being able to carry torches through doors, so let's drop down and have a look. Bounce, bounce, bounce. What a lovely dramatic scream, Link. I don't remember this ladder being here either. Yes, it was. How convenient. Um, are there any torches around? No. I don't remember being able to carry a lit torch through the... Uh, through doors. Hey-ho. Whoops. I despise inverted controls. How's everyone else doing today? We uh, obviously discussed that my positive thing for the day is the fact that I am, of course, playing Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time for the first time in a very long while. But, uh, what's everyone else's positives? Who else has had some positive vibes today? Bonk. Oh, we can carry this out, okay. The issue is... Coming backwards and forwards between the doors... Brings the Spider-Men back. What? Uh, 
Ooh, you have Pokemon Scarlet, so do I. Which starter did you pick? Bearing in mind there is one correct answer. Hell yeah! You chose wisely. The correct answer is, of course, Fuecoco. The fire croc. But also, we might not even make it to the uh, water temple. Because I am already being beaten. <laughs> by the Great Deku Tree. <laughs> Why don't I remember how to do this bit? Because if I climb up those, I put it away. Jumping across this does nothing. A stick back though. But I used the power of gravity before and it didn't break the web. Oh, leave me alone. Goddamn flowers. I thought I hit it properly. Maybe not. Dude, turn around. Thank you. Oh, there we go. I didn't hit it properly. More Deku nuts. There he is. Damn it. Oh, there's a gold boy right there. Oh my god, inverted controls are the worst. Boom! Token! Honestly, man. Inverted controls are the worst.
Ugh. get over to where I need to be. Back up here. If I were to drop straight down onto the ledge, I would die. Oh, you know what? I think I'm being really stupid, like I was when I used to do this. Yes. Yes, I am. I knew it. Whoops! Who remembers how to get that token? Do I need to... No. There we go. We just needed a big old yump. There. Whoops. Why am I so dumb? I'm certain I'm being incredibly dense right now. But I remember this always used to give me trouble. Oh. It's all about making sure I landed in the right bit of water. Oh, come on! Apparently I had my stick out for too long. There we go. Bonk. Teach me something cool. God, the order is two, three, one. Okay, two, three, one. Yeah, that's right, you poop a heart and you run away.
Yes, thank you, Navi. Thank you for that. Thought she was going to give me something useful to listen to. Keep forgetting that I can't move the camera with that analog stick. Ah, yes. I remember this puzzle. We want to do that. And... No. I did it wrong. Man, there was plenty of time that I could have corrected that. Wow. Boom. Now we have to wait for this to come back. Nailed it. Whoops. Thank you for the tool tip, Navi. Sworn I was hearing a spider. Or was it just that? Yes. One, two, there we go. Nope, put it away. Jesus. Got him. Yeah. 
something feels fishy. There it is. No, 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 no. Why did it do that? Okay, that's great and all, Navi, but how do I beat them? Like that. Except that hurts me. Because of course it does. grass to regrow, do a spinning attack, and try and get my hearts back. There we go. No, wrong way. This way. There we go. And enter the boy's hole. going on here then. Let's push this down. There we go. We now have a way back up there. Oops, that was some bad timing. Uh, yeah, so I can't get these, can I? No. I need to... Oh god, I remember this. Let's do that. And that. And then... That worked. Oh my god, thank god there was water there. Whoops. Ooh, it's these guys. Uh, it's two, three, one. So they need to get knocked back towards 
number two. Then towards number three. And then towards number one. Boom. Oh god, the boss. In order to administer the coup de grace, strike with your sword while she's stunned. Oh, Queenie, sorry about that. I forgot there's a boss fight. Who's ready for the boss fight, huh? I'm not. God. Oh, God. Thank you for your vote of confidence. Whoops. How do I trigger the boss fight? Do I need to blast her in the eye with my slingshot? No, I just needed to look up at her. I tried looking up at her before, and it didn't do anything. But that got her. <laughs> Parasite armored arachnid! Okay, let's Dark Souls this up. Learn the attacks. Okay, so we can attack once she's done that and she's stuck in the ground. I might have to use my jumping attack. I is vulnerable when it's red. That's what I was doing! Well, that was not supposed to happen. Oh no. No, this is the bit where she spits out babies isn't it damn it it was red for a second that's one Two. Leave me alone. I want the hearts. There we go. Boom. That's three. Come on down, Queenie. No, no, no. Wrong way. Oh my god, the camera lock on. It is awful sometimes. Ah! No, no, I love it when the camera lock on doesn't work. Oh 
Oh god. No, wait. No, let me see the eye. What a shot taking out all three at once. Come on. Hit me! Oh no, don't do that. That's not what I wanted. Die, 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 die. Damn it. Go red. Yes. Kill, 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 kill. Boom. I wasted way too many slingshot bullets there. <laughs> But that right there is a boss kill. Apologies. Just sorting out a very brief issue with my microphone. Technical difficulties. Stand by. There we go. Heart container. Maximum life increased. Do -do -do -do. Well done. Thou hast verily demonstrated thy courage. I knew that thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now I have yet more to tell ye. Wouldst thou listen? Just in case. But at least we can do this with the emulator, and I could press no, and then if it soft locks us, I can load this save point. Do I press no? See if it soft locks, and reload this save point. I'm gonna make another safety save just in case. But it could be quite funny. Do I say no? <laughs> that's one do it, that's enough for me. <laughs> Wouldst thou listen? No. No, Mitch. Thou must know my time is short. Now listen carefully. Oh, I say it does it anyway. <laughs> A wicked man of the desert cast this dreadful curse upon me. The illusion of choice, absolutely. It's just like playing D&D. &D. <laughs> This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorcerer's powers in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hyrule. It's Hyrule. It's quite cool. Touch it, Frodo. For it is in that sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. It's Hyrule. Before time began, before spirits and life existed, three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. 
Din, the goddess of power. Nairu, the goddess of wisdom. Farore, the goddess of courage. In, with her strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Nairu poured her wisdom in onto the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Faror, with her rich soul, produced all the life forms which who would uphold the law. The three great goddesses, their labors completed, did something, and the golden, golden sacred triangles remained at the point where the goddesses left the world. This is so fast. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our world's something. And the resting place of the triangles has become the sacred realm. Why is this so fast? I mean, I get it if you're just supposed to be reading it, not reading it out loud dramatically like I am. <laughs> Thou must never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on that sacred trice force. Thou must never suffer that man. Ah, yes, the sacred racehorse. Good job, closed captions. Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That evil man who cast the death curse upon me and sapped my power. Because of that curse, my end is high. Though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful, I was doomed before you started. Yes, I will pass away soon, but do not grieve for me. I have been able to tell you of these important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. Mitch, go now to Hyrule Castle. There thou will surely meet the Princess of Destiny. The Princess of Destiny. Take this stone with you. The stone that man wanted so much that he cast a curse upon. Stone number one, the Kokiri Emerald. This is the spiritual stone of the forest, now entrusted to you by the great Deku Tree. The future depends upon thee, Mitch. Thou art courageous. Navi the Fairy, help Mitch to carry out my will. I entreat ye, Navi. Good bye. Oh my god, he just immediately died. Well, let's go to Hyrule Castle, Mitch. <laughs> just immediately. Goodbye, Deku Tree. The Kokiri Forest. Welcome to Kokiri Forest. Do 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 do. <laughs> God, get out of my way! Hey, Mitch, what did you do? Great Deku Tree, did he die? How could you do a thing like that? It's all your fault. I didn't kill him, bro. Yump. 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 
Where am I going? I'm going to the castle, of course. Hell yeah, money bushes. Um... How do I... I don't remember how to get up there. Ah, oh, no! Thank you. <laughs> it's alright, we've only got about seven minutes left of the stream. Thanks for coming down and watching. I hope you enjoyed. Am I just doubling back on myself, or is that the way out? See ya! Weekokiri will die if we leave the forest! You're not gonna try and leave the forest, are you? Well, yes. I'm immediately going to leave the forest. But... But... I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Mitch, because you were different from me and my friends. But that's okay, because we'll be friends forever, won't we? No. I want you to have this ocarina. Please take good care of it. Hell yeah, ocarina acquired. No, bad closed captions. Ocarina. There we go. You received the fairy ocarina. This is a memento from Saria. Set it to C and press C to start playing it. On the select item subscreen, you can set it to left, down, or right. Then use it. Use that C to start playing it. You can play different notes with A and the four C buttons. Press B to quit playing to start or to start your song over again. Yeah, that's the Ocarina of Time. Whole game. Roll credits. When you play my Ocarina, I hope you'll think of me and come back to the forest to visit. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Teach me Saria's song. Teach me Saria's song. No? I get no song? Okay. Okay, he just runs away. <laughs> no Ocarina songs for me. So, I boom. And then I Oh, I might remember how to play a song. Hold on. <laughs> oh. Man, I remember all the ocarina tunes, but we haven't learned any of them yet, so I can't use any of them. So, that is as good as a place as any. Thank you to everyone who uh, came to watch. Thanks for that. I hope you all enjoyed. I had a lot of fun. It was a great little trip down memory lane playing Ocarina of Time. I personally would like to continue with this and do a full playthrough of Ocarina of Time. Um, and then when maybe we do it every other week and 
have something else in between, or we do it every week. Uh, do let me know what you would like to see. Um, if you think every week would be cool, or every other week would be cool, what you would like to see on the other weeks that might be cool, whether it's um, a different Switch game. I do have Legends Arceus, and I do need to get through Legends Arceus. Um, oh, there's a vote already for every week. Maybe we do it every week then, <laughs> until we finish it. Um, obviously, I do have Legends Arceus. We do have the Adventures of Biola Shuff in Dark Souls to continue through. Um, we do need to finish Dark Souls. We're still in Blight Town. Um, yeah. We shall see what we do. But regardless, I will see you next week. And we shall continue with some game or another. But until then, I will see you on Saturday for session four of the Sands of Sildaris, the Practical Heroes' second flagship campaign. But until then, goodbye.